Hi guys, welcome to the channel, quick general love reading for my friends Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know, like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, we are going for a smaller Celtic cross for this one. Let's find out together what's coming through for you, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the Love Arena. Let's see what we can get for you guys. loud shuffle and now we are ready current situation guys the fool the challenge the chariot well this is quite something crowning energy knight of pentacles core of the situation knight of wands past energies justice major arcana future energies possible outcome five of swords the focus two of cups ace of cups bottom of the deck uh, well, a couple of things, guys, right away. In order to embrace a brand new beginning, we need to leave behind a situation that was not fair. Now, um, it's kind of interesting, this flow of energies. Because the Knight of Wands can be about the Five of Swords. The justice is a decision that some of you may have already made. You have already taken some necessary steps in order to allow this brand new beginning. The challenge is to move forward fast. Basically, guys, you or those of you that can resonate of course <laughs> you are embracing the path that uh, these people are following releasing the man with all the swords so a situation that for me as you may know is ego driven it can be a player type of scenario considering the knight of wands at the core of the situation uh, basically if this is a previous partner uh, they cannot stand a chance compared with the Knight of Pentacles that can be the new person that you guys are moving towards at full speed because there is an Ace of... my, my goodness! There is an Ace of Cups and an Ace of Pentacles energy which is the offer that the Knight of Pentacles is holding. This is a major, um, major new beginning blessed by the two of cups something that couldn't be found with the knight of wands five of swords uh individual something that you will find with the knight of pentacles person empress energy bottom of the ace of pentacles a healthy growth remember that the empress is able to uh, recognize what are the opportunities that are deserving of her nurturing and caring energies so that these opportunities, for example, these two aces, can develop and can uh, fulfill the highest possible potential. Guys, this is quite a jackpot, to be honest. It does not come easy because we have the justice as a fair and right decision in order to release a challenging situation that is past related, a clouded situation. Not fair, not uh, entirely honest. So let's try to uh, get things straight. There is the sun, guys, bottom of the Empress. Well, <laughs> So let's keep these energies here because they are so beautiful that they make sense. Let's pull also the sun. So basically, the fool, a brand new beginning, the fool cannot wait to go new places, to embrace the journey at the fullest potential, he is willing to travel light, which I love, because travel with the chariot makes sense, meaning that we are moving forward at full speed, we release the burdens of the past, the, bur the burdens of the past are related to the Knight of Wands, core of the situation, and the Five of Swords at some uh, level. The fool is ready to learn new things so that it can be better and better. The chariot is the challenge that needs to be fulfilled. We need to move forward. 
um, this is an auspicious energy well ace of cups ace of pentacles empress energy and the sun it is about fulfillment happiness uh, for me the chariot uh, gets the feeling like wishing upon a star and allowing the star to guide the chariot to the place where it is supposed to be some of you have already encountered a new person this knight of pentacles that kind of is the one and you are the one for them it's a fated chance in some sense and so the chariot is about the desire coming from some of you guys and some of your knight of pentacles persons to move things forward because a major partnership can take place and it is blessed by the or some of the most high frequencies involved in the tarot deck knight of pentacles uh, the slowest of the four knights in the deck but the most reliable honest trustworthy is holding the ace of pentacles and the ace of pentacles is involved uh, after all in this flow of energies ace of pentacles that is a cornerstone so that we can build upon it for the future solid foundations reliable grounded um, minor arcana for the sun after all so this is a chance an opportunity a new connection that can make you guys extremely happy the same can be said in favor of the knight of pentacles person core of the situation knight of wands the previous partner hot and cold inconsistent not able to match your level of expectations values virtues aspirations uh, no shades um, towards the knight of wands it is just a price that this energy sometimes uh, needs to pay and considering the five of swords and ego driven energy again uh, we couldn't find a way to match uh, with each other this person will be left behind it was not possible um, to fulfill the higher love that we can associate to the two of cups the justice in the past can be i know a legal matters type of energy take it as it resonates for me it's a fair and fair exchange something that was not possible to find in the connection with the knight of wands something that clicked on right away with the knight of pentacles instant uh, ability to be on the same page this is a person that you know particularly well meaning that you have realized that this person was the one for you by interacting with them it can be uh, a connection with uh, or because of work interactions it can be a friend it can be uh, someone that was already involved somehow some way in your life journey and you have realized that uh, they were the one so we have the ace of swords involved in the justice card truth and clarity because the justice lady for me can swing it in a queen of swords fashion this is the ability to take the necessary steps some of you have already uh, started to do that in order to release the knight of wands it will not come easy just because of the fact that the five of swords can be um, a bit resistant as an energy meaning that the knight of wands if they will be left behind they may not like that they may try to um, create some type of discomfort with petty arguments petty fights meaningless interactions you do not care i feel you are ready and willing to embrace the path of these people as we were saying the fool will go for a different uh different road the fool is not bilbo baggins but is uh, living for an adventure ready to go all out the chariot blesses this opportunity uh, so the previous connection was kind of influenced by the five of swords which is an energy that for me resonates with the fact that a person may want to have the last word only for the pleasure to do so when in reality it doesn't really matter this can be even a controlling type of energy maybe this person the knight of wands was uh, someone that uh was working like in a my way or the highway let's do the things that interest me and uh and just those things 
something along those lines. The contrast between the Knight of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles is remarkable. There is, it's a no contest. Uh, this person, Knight of Wands, Five of Swords, dish influenced, doesn't stand a chance. The Two of Cups in the focus is what you can find with the Knight of Pentacles. Um, soulmate energy, we can agree, deep love, sincere feelings, respect, fairness, reciprocal support, empathy, an understanding, gaining strength from one another and learning from each other. There is a huge potential, guys, in favor of the connection with the Knight of Pentacles. Um, bottom of the sun, there is the Five of Wands. It is a touch of competition, meaning that the Knight of Wands, Five of Swords, this individual will not like the fact that you will move towards the Knight of Pentacles, but basically so be it. They will need to uh, make peace with that. Kinda, they had their chance, they uh, didn't make it count, and some of you are in a full chariot mode towards Knight of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Empress, Sun, Two of Cups. Guys, what can I say? It's a lovely flow, super encouraging for those that can resonate with a scenario like this one. It's a fair and right decision because the justice is also involved. Let's pull some oracles for guidance, considering these energies. Let's see what we can discover. Three cards, here we go. Community, you know the Knight of Pentacles. They are in the circle of persons around you, or they were already, and things, things have just happened because maybe they were meant to be. Never-ending story can be the difficult ways coming from the Knight of Wands, Five of Swords dish individual, some type of pattern that was um, meant to be released because of the fairness that we can associate to the justice. And look, excitement, no doubts. Excitement moving forward, Sun Energy, the Empress, the Fairy Lady cannot wait to discover what the journey has in store for her. This can be even the mindset of the fool, ready to go all out on, a, on an adventure. Regeneration, bottom of the deck, which I love, kind of going with the death card. Something completely new, something different. Um, super promising, guys. It's something that can resonate, uh, after all, with the uh, raising from the ashes like a phoenix, because this is indeed a powerful, brand new beginning, super auspicious, full energy, Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, the Empress, about a healthy growth, the Sun, inner happiness and shining bright, the Chariot is success moving forward, and the Two of Cups, my goodness. That's why I was saying that the Knight of Wands couldn't stand a chance, unfortunately for them. So, guys, empathy and integrity wanted to come out. Makes sense. The integrity is a virtue that we can find in the Knight of Pentacles. If you are channeling the Empress power, you can like it quite a lot. You demonstrate the truth and the honesty of your soul and manifest love with your every action. And empathy is one of the factors that we can find within the Two of Cups, the Ace of Cups, for example. You feel and understand the emotions of another in the service of love. The Knight of Pentacles may have been super respectful of the steps that some of you guys may have needed to take in order to close the previous situation and be with the Knight of Pentacles. Friendliness, this can be a friend. You are able to recognize traits in common with another in order to forge love-based connection. connections. Uh, and responsibility, which I love even more. Taking the proper steps, you are aware of the power of your thoughts and the amount of love you express. Guys, this is a lovely flow. Um, what can I say? It is what it is for the Knight of Wands person, but they were caught up in their own ego-driven ways. You are added towards some powerful opportunity 
that can truly bring a wide range of fulfillment in favor of you and in favor of your Knight of Pentacles person. Beautiful reading, guys. I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful. Let us know if you resonate. Comment, like, share, subscribe to the channel. Until next time, I wish you all the best, guys. Take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon. Bye.